So we're back for some revenge here on the Porsche 911 run in stage eight using the one star version of this car tuned as much as possible for a one star. Um, yeah, I've had a couple of times where I've tried this and the 911 on the last ramp lands, flips on its side and explodes into pieces, <laughs> which is fantastic. Really, really is fun when it happens. So if that happens to you guys, Yep, that's happened to me a couple of times too. So, it's not just you. <laughs> now, I point left here at the start to try and see if I can get the AI to actually go down that left path. Just to lure them off. Because the AI loves to be on the same path as the player. Very rarely do AI want to be off on a path on their own. So yeah, if, just, if you point the car towards it, uh, you'll lose a lot of those hopefully at the start. Otherwise, they'll just be kind of bouncing around the place in your way. And this isn't exactly the fastest of cars, so... Especially not at the one-star marker. You really have to do everything you can on this path to get away from them. <laughs> yeah, I did put up that run earlier about this path. But, like, it wasn't quite perfect because AI kind of gave me a few smacks. But it was more just a case of, it is possible. So, I'm just going to put up this one as a... No look, really it is. And you can obviously judge again from your own driving skills and stuff. I'm by far from the best player in Asphalt. But I just kind of show the path that I make use of. Hope that my car doesn't explode on landing here. Which it didn't this time. Hooray! And flip down here for some blueprints in a one star version of the 911 GT3. So yeah, it, it's clearly like possible on that route, but I find once you kind of tell the AI you're going left, just watch how they'll all kind of funnel in that direction. And then, yeah, you go right hand side, hit that first ramp, spiral down into the bottom pad, spiral up again and over the wall. And yeah, I mean, it's not the hardest of courses to take, but you really do need to get rid of the AI as fast as possible and just try to get away from them. And then once you're free of them, go and earn those blueprints and make use out of that incredibly expensive 911. <laughs> but yeah, even at one star. Today's blueprints are at least possible uh, if you are going to chase down that um, GT3 RS. What I would advise here is maybe for now, if you're short on tokens, skip the car. I put another video up on my channel as well about like how to unlock this car and how much it cost me. And it was nearly 6,000 tokens uh, in 10 packs, which kind of sucks. So yeah, just maybe see if you can skip over today. Do so if you unlock the car and think, oh, this thing's terrible. I can't do the track. I uh, can. So <laughs> that's the run to get it done. Uh, good luck following the pad and hope this run helps if it does guys please leave a like or a subscribe on this channel i really appreciate them so yeah i'm gonna leave it at that and we'll see you in the